beautiful choppers. How are you guys today? Thank you for joining me for another official edition of You're in the cut with Chop It Up. I said you're in the cut with Chop It Up. I said you're in the cut with Chop It Up. And if you're new past my channel, hi guys, I'm Pumpkin. We just chop it up over here. Today's subject is Lori Harvey, y'all. Yes, Lori Harvey, Steve Harvey's daughter and Marjorie Harvey's and Future's girlfriend. For now, anyway, y'all, she was um at her apartment and in her apartment building, they have an underground parking lot where all the residents parked their car at. She was retrieving some items that she left in the car after taking, you know, her stuff upstairs and in the parking garage. Basically, there was two young men and they were waiting for her, basically. And um, one jumped in the front seat of her car while she was in the trunk of the vehicle trying to retrieve her items. Lori noticed and reacted, honey. As soon as she saw that guy in the front seat of her car, y'all, honey, she ran up to the front seat and started, like, hitting on the guy, basically. And the guy was pushing her off. And then she continued, yes, y'all, to fight this young man that was sitting in the front seat of her car. I mean, I couldn't believe that. That was pretty courageous to me. Her parents need to teach her that if somebody is trying to take material things from you, you need to let it go, Elsa. Let it go, honey, because there's nothing worth your life. But apparently she came to her senses, you know, and she said um, to herself <laughs> that um, self... I better get the pushing out of here, but so she apparently realized that she had the key fob to her high end luxury vehicle, you know, and so she simply walked away. I mean, she walked away very slowly, guys, like, like she, you know, got on her phone, like there wasn't a care in the world, like you just didn't almost get accosted and your, um, you know, your vehicle taken right from you in your own apartment building. Oh, crrr, she jumped right on that phone and walked away. I would have ran, y'all. I don't understand it. Anyway, um, I would have been a little bit scared. She's telling everybody that she believes that they followed her from the Whole Foods market. But anyway, y'all... <laughs> One of the people so far has been caught. His name is Michael D'Angelo, y'all. And he happens to be, y'all, get this, one of Future's ex-friends, honey. So they had to be laying and waiting for her and following her and watching her to get that close. The other person, I'm not too sure if he's been apprehended or not because there were two... um perpetrators in this situation they did from what i understand take a louis vuitton bag because you remember the second the first guy that jumped into the front seat of the car he went and grabbed something out of the back of the trunk as well as well as the driver did so it was a ten thousand dollar um Louis Vuitton bag that was limited edition that was taken. So they're adding up basically all of her stuff as to about twenty to twenty five thousand dollars in property that was taken from her car. There was only two bags um that were taken. So anyway, what do you guys think? Do you guys think this is what a a setup? Do you think they were this was a retaliation against uh future of course being as though they were his friends and um what you think future gonna do y'all y'all drop y'all comments below let me know what y'all guys are thinking about this i'm glad that Lori harvey is safe but um somebody needs to let her know that she does not need to be fighting over materialistic things because i would have threw the key fob right at them. Like, take the car, take whatever you want. Just get the push at. Oh, because my life means more 
to me than any Louis Vuitton bag and a Rolls Royce. I'm sorry, it just does. I don't know about y'all. But anyway, let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn that subscribe button that is red. Turn that silver for your girl so you won't miss out on any content when I drop it. And let me know what you guys think about <clears throat> Lori Harvey fighting back, child. Yes, she is not nothing to play with. Go ahead, girl. Anyway, thank you for joining me for another edition of You're in the cut with Chop It Up. I said you're in the cut with Chop It Up. I said you're in the cut with Chop It Up. I see y'all around for something. Bye, babies.